What's going on Guardian? Stevie L here, and in this video, we're going to be showing you how you can get your hands on the new exotic sword, the World Line Zero. Now, this is a reward for completing a hidden mini quest of sorts, gathering 35 out of 45 of the hidden lost fragments that are scattered across Mars. Once you've broken 35 of those fragments, you'll get this exotic sword as a reward, and once you've broken all 45 of them, you get yourself an exotic sparrow. And in this video, we'll be showing you exactly where you can find all 45 of these lost fragments. Now, it's like 3 o'clock in the morning and there is absolutely no way I am going to narrate this whole thing. So we're just going to play through most of the locations. Most of it's pretty self-explanatory. You'll be able to see exactly where these fragments are. And hopefully you don't have too much trouble following the structure of the guide. But alright, let's go ahead and get on into it.
All right, hey, so I'm gonna interject here. This is one of the trickier ones. Once you've gotten to this point, you're actually going to need to destroy all of the enemies in the surrounding area. It's the only way to get the door to the inner war mine core to open. So get busy, take out all of the enemies around you, and once you do, you'll be able to interact with the door leading directly to Rasputin. Once you've gotten inside, head to the middle of the bridge, turn left, and you'll notice the fragment on the far side of the room. Whip out a sniper rifle or a scout rifle, put that baby to work, and boom, that fragment's done. Alright, back to your regular guide.
congratulations, you're finally at the end. Now, these final two fragments can be a little bit tricky. In order to open up these doors, you need to leave enemies alive. So as you head into the core terminus loss sector, make your way to that panel, hit it, open up the door, and then make your way towards the final boss room. There's going to be another panel that you'll need to activate. Once you've hit both these switches, you can go ahead, head back, clear up just enough enemies to keep them off your tail, give you a little bit of breathing room, go ahead, pop that fragment, and then head to the final room with the treasure cache. This part can be super frustrating with all the thrall that'll be coming after you, so watch your back. But anyways, once you're in that final treasure room, just take out a couple of the enemies, let the boss go hide in the corner, and then you can pop the final fragment and then, finally, congratulate yourself because you've now found all 45 of the lost fragments here on Mars. That was a lot of work, but you got it done. And now, you're finally ready for your reward. Head back to the start of the core Terminus Lost Sector, and if you go back through the main area, before you hit the room with the first enemy unlock door, take a sharp left. As you do, you'll come across a small corner on the left-hand side behind a pillar. And in that corner, you'll find a very strange cache. If you've gotten at least 35 of the 45 available Lost Fragments, you can open this up to receive the World Line Zero Exotic Sword, the first exotic sword of Destiny 2. And of course, we'll give you a quick look at it right here. Now, we got our first glance of this in the trailer that dropped right before Warmind came out. And it's a very unique sword. It can actually utilize two different heavy attacks. Uh, it can utilize the Phoenix Uppercut, as well as a brand new ability called Tesseract, where you can actually utilize an upgraded version of the Dark Drinker's spin attack by sprinting for a short period of time with this weapon and then hitting the right trigger. The World Line Zero has also got Tempered Edge, Infinite Guard, Assassin's Blade, and the Tireless Blade perks as well. It's a very strong overall entry into the swords that we've got in Destiny 2. It's really cool looking, really powerful, and really fun to play. And we'll have a full review of the World Line Zero coming out very soon. But alright Guardians, that is it for your guide on how you can unlock the World Line Zero. Completing all 45 of these Lost Fragments will also grant you an exotic sparrow. But I was too sleepy to get footage of it. But alright, that's it for this one Guardians. Hopefully it helped you get your hands on this awesome exotic sword. And if it did, be sure to leave us your thoughts on the sword down in the comment section below. That's going to be it for this one. Thank you all so much for watching. As always, I'm the Black Link. You Guardians, stay frosty.